Season of Dreams is finally here. I've been wanting to visit this place ever since I last visited it in my dreams. Who he eh who he hey who pun intended. Oh my god the houses are so nice I want one already. I hope TGC gives us the option to buy houses. If not I'm going to- I know you all are impressed by my ability to slide into buildings at terminal velocity. But let's get back to the main character of this oh my. God. Is that the Colosseum in the land of the Spaggot? I must pay my respect- NOPE! What is there to do in this village I hear you ask? Well. You can raid someone's garage by thrusting yourself through its walls and insert your dominance by claiming it as your own. Headbang next to lamps like the loyal moth you are. No. Show off your true singing skills by finding a comforting spot in the neighborhood and letting go. Spin on your own. Witness the endangered yeti disappear by standing by and doing nothing. Break into someone's house and complain about there being absolutely nothing in their house but air to breathe. Break into someone else's house and find a gap in the space-time continuum and question the quality of construction of these houses. More head banging. Make terrible life decisions and go on a hike that you will most definitely regret. Pretend to be a bell and wake everyone up early with your sheer lungs by calling like a male white bellbird during mating season. Drag your friend into it. Pretend to be Batman and watch over the village in silence. Rave with your friend. <laughs> Chill out in the spa and relax. Staying 5 feet apart from other people because I'm not gay. Give a wholesome speech. Spin with a friend. Win hide and seek by becoming a candle cake. Explore the vast space above the village. No one can stop you. Revisit your childhood by treating the clouds as a bouncy castle. All the while admiring the views of this beautiful map. Unintentionally trigger an out of service transport system involving upside down anchors and floating ducks. Modern art. Spin with more friends. Attempt to relive a spirit's memory but realize nothing is working. So you decide to just stand there and stare, go out of bounds and find this thing. I don't even know what it is but there's a glowing pebble next to it that gives you light. Also you can swim in thin air now. Yay.